multi socket extension port so straight, uh, first of all let's look at the materials required for making an industrial power uh, extension board the material we need as you can see on the video is is uh, the socket five pin socket here we consider five pin socket for three phase uh, our equipment and uh, three pins socket for single phase for those uh, that get using a single phase so these are the things we need and you need to consider the wire and the cable uh, the type of plug and the circuit breaker then the tools required to make this is a screwdriver plier battery drill wire scraper cutter as you can see on the video so these are the tools that we need to make this to get this done now what is uh, um, the industrial power extension extension power board is a power supply distribution unit with multiple sockets of a single phase and three phase uh, socket so by having a three phase and a single phase socket on you, it can be used anywhere the workshop for big and small machine and uh, this will require a power cable as well a power cable is of male and female five piece plugs at the uh, five piece plug at each end which require length of cable so now to make this done to make this get you need to get an uh, electrical wire of appropriate length as per the requirement try to use a minimum length as uh, required so because the length increases the length uh, uh, the higher the length of the cable the increase the resistance the electrical res the resistance will be and this will result to copper loss so every extra length of wire result to power loss in the circuit, electrical circuit so this increase uh, the increase in length of a cable creates a voltage drop across the wires and decreases the amount of power that can deliver by the cable so now let's see uh, the way and manner of uh, connecting this type of uh, industrial uh, socket uh, extension how will you do this connection we will consider um, we can say a series connection connect each neutral face and the head pole of uh, three pins all the three pins in the circuit connect them in series all the neutral let them go to each other from one the neutral of the socket a go to the neutral of socket b go to the neutral of socket c go to the neutral and so on and so forth link all the neutral together and same to the face and same to the head pole in the circuit in series to the main face to the main face when you do all together like this all the uh, face pole you link all together face of the one two three four five six as you can see on the video the neutral you link the neutral neutral one two three four five then the head you link all and all you take it to the main face neutral at the output side of the circuit breaker you can see the circuit breaker at the center at the center of the board so the heartful side of the um, circuit breaker you take the single the face and the neutral that you are bringing you are having two wire at the output after linking all together so you give it to any of the face pole on the circuit breaker at the heartful side of the circuit breaker and you give to the neutral as well as you can see we are using four pole uh, socket circuit breaker in this particular design now um, 
at the heartful, you take that at the heartful side of the circuit breaker and head also to the main one as well. The head that you are bringing, after you have looped all the head together, make sure that you are going to direct the head to the main head that will be coming into the circuit. Now, there's one five pin socket, five, a male five pin socket and a female five pin socket on this uh, on this uh, um, design this fire the male one is going to be an input the male one is going to be an input why the female will be the output that they can use to as a connection point for any uh, machine any equipment anything that uh, is using a three phase in at the, at the, the place of use now this male five pins male we consider this to enhance the safety of the users and uh, on this five pins male we have l1 l2 l3 and the neutral with the uh, the head so this 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 l1 l2 l3 and the neutral Go to input side of the circuit breaker. It will go to the input side of the circuit breaker, and the five pin, uh, the female one, the female five pin, the L one, L two, L three, and the neutral of the female plug will go to the heart side of the circuit breaker. So <coughs> the wires and the parts should satisfy the power requirement depending on the lease which may be used choose a cable with proper gauge according to the load that in them now the circuit breaker was used for protection and safety of the circuit it prevents overcurrent and overload so main socket was used as input for uh, users uh, safety as well also, the power cable should not be rolled or coiled when the, uh, the board is on use. The coil, if you coil a cable, this can cause an inductive reactance across the coil and that will drop the voltage that will travel across the wire. So, thanks so much for listening. I am Kabir Kamil. Subscribe to our channel to for our next uh, uh, the next topic that we will share with you thank you bye bye have a nice day